So here, here's what Clifford claims. Clifford claims that in order for you to be entitled to your belief, uh, for, it has to have sufficient evidence. And for it to have sufficient evidence, it has to conform to the uniformity of nature and conform to the common human experience. That's one part, right? That your beliefs have to have sufficient evidence. That's one, one part of his claims. Another part of his claim is that if your beliefs do not have sufficient evidence, then you must withhold judgment. If you don't have sufficient evidence, you must withhold judgment. Okay. Now, this the second claim about withholding judgment. Is there sufficient evidence for this? So, you know, he makes... These are some substantive claims, right? Is there sufficient evidence for the claim that if you don't have sufficient evidence, you must withhold judgment? 